Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of my Darkness Falls series. So it is the morning of day 26, two days away from the Horde, um, and it's been about two weeks since I've done a recording for this series. Uh, I did a batch record when I did the first 25 episodes. I couldn't stop playing. I did it in like three days. Um, so uh, I decided to take a break to at least get a bunch of episodes posted to get comments and stuff back on them. Uh, but yeah, so um, I kind of am not really sure. I, I, I'm a little bit sure of where I left off, but a little bit unsure of where I left off. So what I want to do today, I'm putting this stuff away for now because I don't want to go and jump in to do stuff um, unless I know for sure what I'm doing is what I should be doing. And I put all that stuff there. We're going to go out and do some quests today, I think. Uh, we got a bit of time before the horde. Now, I think um, we had, yeah, we got the power door here. We got the spikes moving. We had doors going in here, which are moving right now. Nothing going on in there. We had concrete moving in here, which we got a bunch of now. So we're gonna need for that, we're gonna need those for the gatehouses, I believe. Put that up there. And those, and do we have anything going on here? No. That's all our paint and stuff. Okay, just getting uh, reoriented here. Uh, we have no fuel. Let's get some fuel real quick. 95. Um, getting closer. 82. Come on. One more. There we go. Beautiful. And then what about you? How are you doing? You still need the same. So... I think that should be it. Yeah, pretty close. Yeah, good enough. Good enough, let's just get that going. Uh, okay, we have anything going, on, anything going on in here. This is another advanced forge. Some junction boxes, we got a few more coming out of there. Let's pull the advanced forged out. Forged, forge out. I have no, I have no idea where I'm gonna put this thing now. Um, I don't wanna block the windows in case I need to get out of here. Let's just throw it there for now. We're gonna really have to work on our situation here. So what do we have working in here? We've got concrete or cement mix. We've got darts working in there. Now do we have iron? We've got a little bit of iron. Oh, we got a bunch of iron. Okay, so let's take those. We have our... We're running with nerdy goggles now, right? I'm pretty sure I am. No, I got my lucky looter goggles on. So where's my nerdy goggles right here? Let's wear those for a second. And then let's get... Oh, you, see, it's weird. You come with bellows already. Do we have... We don't think we have a crucible ready for you, do we? Um, doesn't look like it. Anvil. I mean, I guess we could do forged iron, because I'm going to need a crap ton of forged iron, too. I've been thinking about what I want to do and how I want to defend this base. So let's go with some forged iron. Uh, anvil can go in. That'll give me forged iron. How much can we get? 1,200? Let's just do a thousand and get that started. We'll save a little bit of the iron in case I've made a mistake and need it for something else. All right, now before we go, we got the mastery master mechanic book here. So let's throw that down. Yeah, man, master mechanic. Talk to the mechanics. All right, so skills. Let's go to mechanic. So we've got our master mechanic skill which gives, opens up the impact driver. So we can see if we can make one of those. Oil pump, which I'm not sure if that, what that does, that just, you know, pumps oil every day or what it does. Auto shotgun, motorbike, four by four, a muscle car recipe, increases crafting tier by 10 for blunt weapons, shotguns, and wrench style tools. Okay. So let's have a look at, I think we need to build, um, I don't know if it's here. Metal workstation, laser, mechanics workstation. Why can't I build that yet? Grease, oh, it's, all right. Um, level three, right. We had the point for that, beautiful. So now we can open the mechanics workbench. Is it in here that we make it? Mechanics workstation, that's nothing. Sports steel, mechanical parts, wood, perfect. We'll, ha we'll set it to go there. So when we come back today, it'll be done. And then we can look at 
building a car, so we'll, we won't look at spending the entire day away from the house. So mechanical parts. I want to pick up a bunch of mechanical and electrical parts. I know we've got a lot of electrical parts as it is. It was steel, I believe. Uh, yes, it is. So let's craft one of those. We get a so we can get a motorbike going first, probably. All right. So quest-wise, how are we doing for quests? We got to eat and drink before we go too. Um, do we have anything on the go? Uh, these are all the completed ones, so we don't have anything. All right. Um, got any jobs? Fetch to the east. Any fetch clears? Buried supplies. Another fetch. Clear zombies. Fetch. It's all fetches. So what's this one? I'm in a bit of a quandary. Holler. Can you help me? Hollier. Uh, yeah, sure. Whatever oh, that is. I don't think we've been there yet. I will make it so let's eat and drink something. We'll go get some stuff from Jen. Did I make anything? Nothing there. And nothing there. Okay, so I really need to make food. Because uh, it doesn't look like we have a lot. Although I do have... I'm just going to use... I do have um, fruit salad on the craft right now in my inventory, so I might as well just drink... Oh, we got these guys. I forgot about those. A little better. We'll just drink these, and then we'll have the fruit salad to eat on the way out of here. So let's go do the quest. Is two of them. Get one from her. Good morning, survivor. Yeah, what's going on? What's going on? Uh, you got any jobs? We gotta go do a job today. I gotta clear my mind here. Fetch clear northeast. Sure. City park. Oh, thank goodness. I couldn't find anyone to do that job. No one wants to go to the park? Man, I'll go, I'll go to the park. All right, we gotta get this door updated today too, if we can. We'll do that later on. All right, close her up. Let's head out. Okay, the park should be right here. Got a bit of lag, like chunky lag bits happening. I think we got a lot of zombies spawning in. All right, we're gonna park it right here. What's up, lady? Look at them all. Oh, uh, we gotta save this guy first. Skate <laughs> your leg. Oops, I'm sorry. Shouldn't be power swinging. Get back here. Ah, damn it. That was my bad. I guess I shouldn't be helping people when I'm, like, haven't played the game in a while. Come here, you. I'm gonna take my aggression out on you. We got another guy over there in the distance. We got two in the distance, three in the distance. Let's go get them real quick before we go in here. I mean, it shouldn't really matter, but... It's always nicer just to clear out the ones in the- yeah, there's a whole bunch here. Hey guys. Look at them all. Here. Well, that guy's sleeping. That's alright. So I turned the difficulty up a little bit. I don't think it's gonna matter though. I turned it up to Nomad. It doesn't look like it's affected the hit points of these guys at all. I'm hungry. I'm hungry for a fight. Another one. Yeah, I don't think it matters. Because I think the game... Um, the game has got set difficulties, I think. Ah, that should have been a hit. Oh, come on. There we go. She got the bag too, that's nice. All right, let's go active, ah, oh, for Christ's sake. I think the game has got a, like fixed difficulty increases for zombies. Because even though they're set on jog, they're really not moving that fast. I think they're just all pre-programmed, which is kind of nice. But I know the difficulty later on, it's gonna get like crazy, like some of the zombies later on are just nuts. So I, I understand not wanting to, to shift it up. Although I did change the Horde Knight to 12 zombie Horde Knight. So there'll be a few zombies, a few more zombies per wave on Horde Night. All right, let's just see if we can work through this real quick. Yeah, I know you're upset. That's my bad. What they should do is try to find a way to, for the difficulty settings, just to give the zombies armor. 
Ooh, you're taking it like a champ. You know, like... So give them the same amount of hit points, but maybe like a slight bit of armor per level that you go up. So I'm on Nomad right now, which is only one step up from Adventure, which is the, the default start. I think I made a whole bunch more arrows. Ooh, that's a miss. He's picking up speed. It's like he started off slow and then just kind of picked up a little bit of speed to get to me. I see the snake, just in case you're wondering. I see it. Just want to get this guy started. We got work to do today and I don't want to be here forever. Yeah, textures are still messed up. So I, I guess it's at this point in the game. I, I, I'm not going to be able to correct them. I do have kind of like an offline playthrough. I'm on a really early day stage, but the textures are fine. So I don't know, maybe it's just at a certain point. I, I don't know. I don't know what to say. Another snack. Get, get one to mow in the head. Oh, you're a runner. Doesn't matter though. Oh, you know what? I forgot to change out to my looting goggles uh, before we left. Crap. Oh, come on. Ooh, chainsaw. Let's just ditch this. Don't need it. Who's next? We got a biker in here. It's the bag from earlier. What's up, buddy? Just gotta kinda predict where he's gonna go. Big Mama should die. Oh, nope. Maybe that's what it did. At 200 hit points, she should have probably died with a sneak sneak bow attack. Unless I don't have any points in the bow. Which is... No, I do. I got three. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. Oh, hey. What's up, buddy? Oh, and I, I didn't forget about you. I didn't forget about you. Let's get rid of that guy so we don't have to worry about him bugging us when we're trying to kill these guys. That's a cop. I see your head in there. Uh, I don't know. Well, doesn't matter. Now the cop we shouldn't be able to get in one shot. So, I'm going to see how fast my bow skills are here. Is that a snack? That's a snack. I see you, little bastard. That was a bag or something hiding there. Alright, we should probably kill the uh, spider monkey over here first. I got a feeling that things with this cop are not going to go so well. One more. There we go. The cops are always nice getting uh, bags from. Because they usually drop gun parts. If I'm not mistaken. Yeah. Pistol barrel. Nice. It's all quiet. Oh, no it's not. Just when you think it's safe to go back into the water. Ooh. Yeah, you first. You first! Murder! Murder, death, kill. Okay, we got an irradiated guy. And who do we have in here? Do we have anybody in here? I don't know. Maybe. I don't think so. Nope, looking pretty quiet. There is somebody right here, though. That part of the park is clear. That's ah, a biker. You done? You done. We got three left. Probably in these buildings. Question is, can I get in them there? Locked. Alright, well. Let's wake him up. 
Let's wake him up. Come on. Stop lagging. I got zombies to kill. Calculations. All that for a duster, huh? Hey, buddy. Is that just you in there? It is. We got two over here or one? Military guy. No, it's not a military guy. It's me being blind. Is there somebody over here? No? Oh. You see how fast I can attack? Pretty good, eh? You like that? Now, there's one left. Where the hell is he? Like... Oh, it's a snack. Where is it, though? Was it in here? Oh, there's a thing there. Okay, maybe it's under there. Let's go in here and find out what's in here. Then we'll loot this place and get out of here. Yeah, I think it's underground. That's locked. Didn't know this was here. Oh. Just gonna keep that snack in there, are you? Is that all it is? Just in case somebody wants some live snack. Ooh, not, not what I wanted to do. There we go. Done. Oh, texture's back, looks like. It's just a... What, you know, what would that be for? I can't even imagine what you would use that for. Take the plastic. Alright, I'm gonna loot this place. I'll show you what we get at the end here. Cause it's like... Ooh, scrap that. I can scrap this. Cause I have no idea what's gonna be in here. Alright, let's loot it up. So I figured out what was in these, what was supposed to be in here. We got a safe in here. I'm just gonna quickly crack into this sucker. I should have brought my looting goggles, but... Oh well, another sledge. Oh, we got something out here. Oh, it's a pig. Got buddy. Alright, let's keep looting. Alright, that should pretty, pretty much do it. There's a couple things of garbage over here left, but... We didn't do too bad. I mean, I did break up all the garbage in here, so any garbage that I, that I looted stuff from, I broke up. Just in case I'm passing back through here and I see some more garbage, I know I haven't actually hit it up yet, so... Let's see what we got here. We didn't do that bad, so we can scrap these. Scrap these. Um, so we got a little bit of lead, a little bit of brass. Uh, a couple things to sell. Might as well scrap those. I can scrap the nails, I think. I can always make them. Got some dye. Which, not the important dyes, but we got some. So yeah, I mean, we did okay. I got a pistol barrel and uh, whatever other crap. Let's just drop some stuff in the bike and we'll keep going over to the other one here. So storage. Uh, we do have food and drink in here, which is nice. So four of those. And let's drop... How many do we want to keep here? Five, six, seven, eight. All right. Drop what we can in there. Not too many. All right. Let's use a couple of these guys and then we'll get out of here. Actually, let's just use all three of them. Might as well. I might as well use both of these while we're at it. And then we can drop, like, I don't know. Pistol barrel in there for now. This other stuff we might find along the way. Alright, where is our second one? Down there. Ah, oh, shit. This was a fetch clear? Where were the supplies? Damn it. Ah, oh, man. Really? All that for nothing. I know you're, <laughs> you guys are probably all screaming, Oh, you didn't do the fetch. I thought that was just the clear. Ah, for crap's sake. Well, alright. Let's go do the other one then. Well, you can certainly tell I haven't played this game in a couple of weeks. Alright. Holler storage. This is just a fetch, so... Wow. Okay.
just a fetch. Hey, what's up? I'm gonna loot this bike while you uh, figure out what you're doing, alright? Oh, three shotgun rounds. Alrighty. Let's go for a walk around the building, I think, first. Oh, you stop walking, you bastard. Hate when they do that. Just in case we got sleepers on the outside, another snack. Another Kenny. We got you. Yeah, I guess you to walk right into that. Alright. Looks like it's quiet out here though. Yeah, it's all quiet. All right, well, where do we go in? Around the back? Why would you have... Why would you have this on the front and not at the back? Oh, you're still going, eh? That got you. That got you. Stopped you right in your tracks. Look at you. Ah, oh, fuck. Really? So many zombies. We need to kill. Oh, going a little faster than I thought. And you stopped. Because of course you stopped. Nope. That's gotta hurt. You still going? You were, and now you're dead. Alright, side door. Locked. We're going in this way. All right, we got to go up uh, upstairs. After we myrtleize some of these guys. I think you're still going. Yep. Quiet, quiet, quiet. We got a cop in there. Got to remember we got the P225 on it. So that's the back door cuz we can see out there. Can I get a shot at your head? I don't think we can. How many hit points you got? 475. So you're feral. Uh, don't see anybody else though. I wonder if we just open up on you. Well, let's wake your ass up this way. Ooh, right up Main Street. Hey, buddy. See a friend of yours? Apologize for that. Yeah, now we got... See, that's why you want to clear the zombies around the building. Oh, hey. What's up, eh? Love tap. Make sure you're dead. Alright, let's go clear these guys. Yeah, you know, you just want to make sure that around the outside is clear so when you do go to town on people inside... You don't end up with another 20... Where, do, where are you? How are you here? I circled the building. Oh. Oh, that's gotta hurt. Oh, hey, it's a cop. Well, it does feel a little more difficult. Maybe I'm... I wonder if they came from the roof. Could have been a wandering horde, I guess, but they could have been on the roof. Oh, there's a balcony here too, maybe. I don't know. Let's go inside. Where are you? Oh, there you are. Alright, let's go finish this place up. So it's on this floor. I should just make the assumption automatically whenever I'm going to do a quest now. Okay, so you guys didn't wake up. I should just always make the assumption that I'm going to pick up a uh, thing. You got a bit of speed to you, huh? What did you stop for? That was your mistake. If you're going to commit, commit. 
do half ass bullshit. That's how you get killed. Okay, we gotta go up one more here, it looks like. Good thing you didn't wake up. Oop. That's not good. <laughs> a little bit of an ass spanking there. Alright, where's our... There it is. Alright, so this one's... At least we know it's done. Let's go upstairs and see if we can find some main loot here. I wonder if those guys came off the roof or if it's going to be... Nope. Alright, let's do... The threats first. I always seem to take more damage from birds than anything. Ooh, that's juicy. Can't see that guy's head yet. We might be able to get this guy. Well, get him in two anyway. What about you? No, you're dead. Alright, nice. The only thing I don't like about, uh... Yeah, not much up here. The only thing I don't like about the non-fetches, or the non-clears I mean, is you don't get that little satisfying click that says, yeah, you're done. You know? Yeah, somebody's making their way in. Let's just loot up here and get out of here. We got a treasure map, that's nice. Wonder if I should pop that right now. Ooh, that box isn't too bad. That's not too bad. Grab this. Uh, we definitely want to grab these. And my reason being is that we're going to need all the brass we can get to feed our SMG turrets. Oh shit, it's a white. So are you part of a wandering horde? I wonder if that cop was part of a wandering horde too. Could very well be. You think if that guy was a want part of the wandering horde to be more, but... I wonder if he just ran by not hearing me and the other guys heard me. That's a possibility. Nothing under there. Alright, let's get down here. Another treasure map. That's awesome. We got two treasure maps today. Maybe we go out on the treasure hunt tomorrow. Although I should really be focusing on, uh... Yeah, that guy. Ah, uh, you're still outside. I should probably really be focusing on getting that base up for the next, um, Fortnite. Although we're pretty much already there. I just need to wire it up and get the last bits of concrete in place. You know, it's pretty much set to go, so... Maybe we do do the treasure maps tomorrow. Alright, let's go down and kill this guy here. Where are you? Oh! Is there more than one of you? There's a white there too. Hey buddy. Wanna see how fast my gun shoots? Yeah? Pretty fast, huh? Shoots pretty fast. You don't mind if I just come out here and steal your loot, do you? Take that. Yeah, maybe they came off of here. That's the up that's the upper uh thing. Yeah. Alright, let's finish looting this place and get out of here. Ah, uh, somebody else outside. We're just about done here. What are you doing? There's a door, open door right here. We gotta grab that before we go too. the other loot bag. Alright, let's see what else we got in these boxes. We're in the last room here. Ooh, got some arrows back from today. That's nice. A little bit more ammo. Oil. Wish we could do like, have like a Molotov in, uh, launcher. Uh, I'm just gonna scrap that because we can, um eventually get the uh, recipe for that. We'll grab these monitors in a second. What do you got here? Some bones. All right. Yeah, like all the uh, food recipes, we can just spend a skill point and crank up our uh, sous chef and be able to get those. All right, I think I'm done in here. So we got the two treasure maps. We got a little bit of stuff to scrap here. 
uh, some more paint. Um, yeah, so we did okay. Might as well just use this. Just scrap that, scrap that, scrap that. So it's done by the time we get back. A little bit of thing, a few things to sell. So I mean, you know, other than me making the mistake of missing that last, uh, <sighs> missing the last um, mission, we did pretty good today. Yeah, could have been better. You're still alive. I think you were part of the Wandering Horde too. Love how they kind of ramp up their speed. Oh, I wonder if my arrow is slowing them down. That might make sense. Alright, let's get back. Alright, so just heading into the park by our house. Looks like these things have uh, gone ahead and uh, popped here. So let's have a look at what we got out of these guys. One egg. Some feathers. More feathers. Alright, couple more eggs. Alright, so that was actually pretty... That was worth it. Yeah, I don't have to stop for uh, bird's nests anymore, I don't think. Unless they're, like, right there. I'll probably just ignore them for now. Should be able to get lots of feathers and stuff off there. Now, uh, I gotta think about what I want to do here for entrances for this next horde. Yeah, we had a guy break through here. Mo broke through here a little while ago. Forgot to bandage that up. Broke through there last night. Um, right over the spike too, which is like a little bit concerning. Are they going to go right over top of the spikes and get in? Makes me wonder if I should have put them on the wall facing outwards. So they have to actually beat through the spikes to get in. Because I've been thinking about how we're going to run the, the base moving forward. And I thought about digging a trench around the outside, right? So like uh, kind of go down one and across and then up one. So like have it two wide or three wide. But then I have to like replace the sand on both sides because if we get like cops or dogs or whatever that run in there and then explode, they're going to blow up all the ground underneath. So all that has to be replaced with concrete. Um, which is a lot of material. So I'm wondering if we do the outside here like, take all these metal plates off, double up the wall, so the inside would be the double, we wouldn't do it on the outside, because I like the aesthetic of this, and then put spikes facing outwards all the way around, so when the zombies come up, if they want to break through, they got to break through the spikes first, and they'll sh they should be taking damage as they're trying to get through. Like, I like the idea of the barbed wire so they can't climb up. So we could have barbed wire up here too, like maybe on the wall as opposed to like, oh maybe out like this way is probably the best way. That way if they're here and they're trying to jump up on each other, they'll get into the barbed wire. So there's that, which I think is probably the way to go. I'll probably just test it out, see how it works. It might be great and it might not be. It might end up being garbage, who knows. We can, But at that point I can always add the trench afterwards, right? That's an easy enough thing to do. Did we lose something there? No? Okay. Uh, yeah, that's an easy enough thing to do is add the trench afterwards. So... And then we'll have rolling doors. What I want to do, I was actually thinking about doing, is like right here on this side. So like probably... Right here. This bit right here. I want to put... Like an entranceway over here first of all, with the rolling door, to get into where the base is. Right, right in there. So that they can get into where we are. And then on this side, right here, and around the front, take this out, put a rolling door, like a powered rolling door in here, like with sensors on it, which we can leave closed during Horde. And then, um, and maybe have like a small moat here, with spikes in it, that drops down, and a drawbridge that goes across it that's powered so that we can drive in one side it'll open up we drive in then there's that little uh, room inside there with the uh, uh, what's it called um, player vending machines 
Uh, we use that as the, uh, the car park. And then, so when we drive in, we drive into the car park, park, and then when we leave the next day, we have it reverse on this side, like right here. Right? We have it reverse so that, I mean, there's still a, I don't, maybe not, maybe there isn't a drawbridge on this side or something. Maybe it's a double door. I don't know yet, but we have one on this side that we can just drive out and it will sense our car, open the door, and then we can get out. That's my thought. Anyway, I think that would be kind of cool. So you drive in one way, then you drive out the other way. All sensors. We don't have to worry about opening doors anymore. Alright, get all that cleaned up for now. Okay, let's get inside. we got a couple of hours left before the morning. Or before nightfall, that is. So, I think I want to start... ...working on putting new doors in to get access to this base here. Ah, come on. And I think I'm going to avoid the wires for the new, um, for the new doors. Like, we'll probably put a door here for this side. The other door will go, like, here for this side. Right? And then they can, we'll have these that they can open up and into. I want to have them stick out a little bit and into here a little bit. So that they're not like this one where it all kind of pushes back into the base. I want to have it half stick out and half be in the base. So we got to figure out how that's going to work. Like maybe just push it out one block, you know? Because it's already one block out on this side. Kind of. I mean, it's flush with these, right? So we move it out one more. Does it have to be this wide, though? It probably, like this is like five wide, so we're going to be knocking out pillars. Like, we're gonna be knocking out pillars back here. Like, these have to come out. So let me think about that. I'll probably knock that up tonight. Put the doors in tonight. And I'll show you guys in the morning. Like, this one's gonna be tough because it's gonna be right up against the stairs if we do it here. Maybe this one sticks out a bit more. I don't know. It's gonna obstruct the guards' line of sight, though. But they're not doing much anyway. So, and we've got a little bit more work to do out here. We've got to get these knocked in. I'm not really worried about this being upgraded to steel. Although, I, maybe I should do the posts down below in steel. You know? Yeah, let me think about it. And then I think we have to knock... Because it's day 26. We've got two more days. Two more full days. So, maybe tomorrow... Like, tonight I'll get as much done as I can. I think I will knock these in with uh, concrete so they're at least dry. How am I going to put the wire though? Like, I mean maybe it doesn't have to be, maybe it comes from that wall across to there maybe like start uh, on this wall, have it kind of come across on an angle to this wall so that when they're here they run into it and that they run past it, they run into it here again. I need to have a couple of them, one up and one down. So that there's, you know, at least the, um, like I'd have the lower set on first maybe, and then when they die, the upper set comes on. Like I flick a switch and the upper set comes on. I'm gonna need switches in here too, so we need lots of room for switches, so. We got like, maybe not there, cause the, well, they're not too bad, they're kind of hidden. Like maybe here, not there, there, and then when we block this up we'll have one here too. Although maybe I should use this as a, in case the something like the stairs or something over here break, I can just like throw in stuff here real quick with wood so that they can at least come this way and we leave this in place just in case. That's a possibility too. Yep, but for now we're going to leave it like this. Uh, I got to get the plates out here. I wasn't able to get, I was going to put a five long plate in here, but I had to put individual plates in, which is why I made so many of them. So those will be in. I got the darts crafting, so we should have a ton of darts. I try to get enough so that these would be, you know, at least half full each. 
Yeah. So, all right. Let's get inside here real quick. Dump this stuff off. Oh, we got to turn our quest in. Is it to you, isn't it? Yeah. You've made my day. Pocket mod. Here's your payment. It's worth the most. All right. Uh, never mind. Let's go down. Go to the bike. Where's our bike? Down here, right? Grab the stuff out of the bike. Can we fit it all in our inventory? Yeah, we can. Nice. Let's go sell some stuff here. I apologize for not. Uh, Good morning to my favorite customer. Yeah, I'm not that favorite anymore. I, I yeah, I kind of didn't pick up the package that I was supposed to pick up. So that's you know kind of my bad there. Let's just take these dies out of here. If anything, if it's not the colors we need, we can always. Uh, I can't sell that. I can always scrap them down for paint. I don't even think you can scrap the uh, Juudel die. Uh, the purple. The purple. I think that's probably it for paint. All right, let's sell her some stuff. Sell you a little bit of stuff here. That can go. You can go. You can go. Goodbye. Goodbye. Yep. Yep. Um, we'll hang on to the sledges for now. See what we got inside. You don't want the spear, huh? What about the knuckles? We don't need any more pocket mods. Am I correct? I should check that first. Don't need the chainsaw. It's just a friggin' screamer attraction. Um, let's have well, a quick look here. My day. Did I? Well, I got I'm some more I stuff to sell you, you, maybe. Oh, I don't know why I kept the turrets here. Oh, wait. That's just kind of gross. <laughs> <They're not laughs> let's say I never gave you any shit. All right. Um... Uh, what was I looking for? I was looking for something. What was I going to do? <laughs> Until I found the poop. Let's just read both of these so I can maybe remember what I was trying to do. That's not too far away. Read you. We got one. They're both kind of in the same direction, so maybe that's a mission for tomorrow. Um, along with some quests. Oh, I was going to check my pockets. That was what it was. Uh... So I got a triple there, a triple there, and a triple there. Nice. I can sell this one. Sell these guys. And I don't really have any use for you. Oh yeah, this can go. And where's this storage pocket mod? That can go too. Yeah, I might as well sell that. Um, what else? I think that's it. You won't take that. But you might take it tomorrow. Tomorrow's the 27th, so we'll come back tomorrow and see if she wants that. All right, let's take this stuff inside. I hope you get feeling better. Yeah, so do I. So I was thinking about expanding this place, like, out here. Knock that out so that we can't cross across to there. Maybe put a drawbridge in if we want to. But then, like, put the... Because we're making this our car park. This could be where all our crops go if we wanted to, on top here. Or knock it out and add, have the building extend across. That's the other thing we could do. Alright, light's coming on. That's nice. What do we got going in here? Alright, lots of stuff happening. Alright, so I'm going to put all this stuff away. And then um, tomorrow we'll go do those treasure maps, I think. Try and get as much stuff crafting as possible and knocked out tonight as possible for the base. Like, I, I we definitely have to get... Um, we definitely have to get the walls uh, taken down with the doors in. So I'm going to try and do that tonight. Um, and if I can't get it done tonight, then definitely it'll have to be done during the day on the 28th. Uh, I'm going to upgrade all the stuff I think we need to upgrade with concrete and with steel. How much steel do we have? we got a bunch of steel, so we're okay for steel. So I'll get what I can upgrade, get what I can upgrade it to steel. Um... So I feel a little bit better about the uh, base defense, and then we'll go from there. All right, so I'm going to end the episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If it did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. You can also drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.